What's going on guys? Gomes here. Or at this point, rather just a vessel that houses caffeine. Uh, that's about the only thing keeping the tank running, keeping the batteries charged. Uh, we got a update today, I think. Uh, isn't it weird, me covering an update? Uh, I guess I only missed one. Uh, maybe like two or three on the year. Uh, that's a pretty good report card if you ask me. Um, but we have new content in the day uh, that we're going to discuss. And some more stuff. So leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel. If you guys are new, we hit 64K the other day. That's pretty cool. Now we're looking for 65. Also, again, reminding I'm going to be at Wrigley tonight for the game. If you guys are going to go, hit me up on Twitter. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitter. It's going to be in the description as well as the pinned comment. Here we go. Uh, so I know that we have a new player program. I think that's probably the most relevant. Who's it going to be? Dave Parker. Okay. Very big name, very uh, highly sought after card, I'm sure. Uh, oh, come, let me stop talking shit. Uh, so the battery's about going to die. The DualShock 4, yes, uh, we are on PS4 here. Uh, pipe down. Uh, Dave Parker, 91. <clears throat> let me try that again. Not sounding like a prepubescent this time. Dave Parker, there we go. 98 to 84 contact, respectively. 85 71 power. Uh, 90 vision, 67 fielding, 90 arm. So he's not going to be able to catch a fly ball. You know, throw it in once he, uh, you know, picks it up off the turf. So that's a nice attribute to have, I suppose. Uh, 61 reaction uh, and 54 speed. So uh, this is, of course, probably not going to be a starting quarter outfielder for you. I probably shouldn't have to say that. Um, but it is XP. It's 30k XP for the third inning program. If you guys are still looking at getting uh, Troy Gloss, Gritty Sizemore or Dennis Eckersley. Uh, so, again, as always, the uh, formula to get this card is going to be quite simple. You're going to have to do, well, there's technically different ways to do it, but the most wise way to do it would be uh, these moments, which, you know, hit one home run, not too bad, nothing seems uh, too frustrating per se. Do those moments, and then you're going to want to play the Cincinnati Reds and All-Star difficulty. And uh, what do you know? 30k XP and uh, you know, a collection fodder. Uh, maybe gets you closer to Mariano Rivera. Who knows? Uh, probably not much more than that, I suppose. Uh, yes. Oh, oh my God, Gomer, do you even play this game? Yes. Uh, this uh, TV, this PS4 that I'm on, uh, is unplayable. It's at like 12 frames a second, and Etch a Sketch moves a little bit quicker. Uh, so I'm going to. You know, reimburse my grinding once I get back. Uh, oh shit, Tops Now came out today. That's right. Uh, okay, so a bit more substantial update than I uh, had initially thought. I think this also does essentially confirm that uh, not Ducks on the Pond, not Space Pack. The Kitchen Sink Pack 3 is going to be coming out next week. Here we have Cliff Floyd. Uh, 104, 98 content. Oh shit, you know. This is actually, you know, it's not good defensively, of course. Cliff Floyd cards never are. But 95, 93 power alongside great contact both ways. A fantastic left-handed swing, 71 speed. And if you get him up to third parallel, he already has that left field spot. So that's where you're going to want to play him. Uh, you're going to have to get him up to P5 to get him to 70 reaction, which is, you know, admittedly a bit tough. That's not ideal in any sense of the word. But uh, not bad. That being said, I don't think this card's going to go for that much on the market. Now, that being said, it's not going to be a budget card, but this could be an interesting one for you guys. If you really like Cliff Floyd's swing, you're going to get him to about 100 power both ways. Uh, this is pretty damn good. That's a pretty good uh, hitting headliner card. First time I'm saying that in quite some time. In a Baltimore Orioles road uniform. So, woo-wee. Uh, good looks on that front. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the new Tops Now cards here. Uh, should be Four diamonds if they do it the same way they did last week. Uh, we have Robbie Ray with 80 BB9, 80 walks per nine. Holy shit. I kind of like this setup, not having to move myself. This is pretty nice. I mean, you're not going to get to see the bottom of the card, so, uh, you know, maybe a little bit of a tease, strip tease for you, but, uh, okay, you can deal with it. Uh, not a lot of stamina, not a lot of hit nine. Luckily, hit and K9 do essentially the same thing. Uh, so that 97 kind of reimburses the low hit per nine. 80 BB9, like I said, bit of an oddity for Robbie Ray, but it's been deserved. His walk rate's been down this year. Uh, five pitches, two breaking balls, a changeup, two fastballs. Uh, differentials are, you know, kind of on par, average. 
Control is really not bad. The two seamer's the worst, but you shouldn't be throwing that two seamer really anyway. So that's great. That's probably the pitch you don't want to have too much control on. Um, then the break on the changeup. Um, I mean, I don't know. It's a decent card. A lefty. It's kind of the meta right now. There's definitely better cards out there. But that being said, uh, it's definitely not bad. Mike Talkman, the Sockman. Robbing pool holes of game winners, hitting grand slams, uh, and getting 89 overall top snow cards that uh, have 58 power against lefties. So that's not great, of course. Um, but against right handers, 92 and 99 splits, 52 speed. Uh, the defense, 81 fielding, 67 arm, 84 reaction. Again, you know, it's an 89 overall top snow card. It's not going to be amazing. Here we got Brock Holt. Uh, God, it's weird seeing him on a team that's not the Red Sox. Uh, well, I guess he was for like half a season, then went back there. A uh, ton of contact, 70 power against righties. Uh, can play every position except pitcher and catcher. Uh, 34 speed, uh, which is not great. Um, but that's not a horrible card, I guess. You know, if th this is a budget card. You know, if you want somebody on your bench who can just fill a bunch of slots and uh, can get on base for you, that's going to be Brock Holt. His piece size is going to be massive. Uh, so that's something to look, uh, I don't know, I wouldn't say looking forward to, but something to look at, uh, I guess. Anthony De Schlafani here uh, for the Red Hot Giants. You know, coming out playing the D-backs, I guess anybody's going to be scorching fucking hot. <laughs> Christ, man. Any D-back fans out there, uh, here's a shoulder. You can cry on it. I, it's tough, man. They don't even have that bad of a... Well, I, I can't say they have that good of a team, I guess, either. Um, Dish Lafani. Uh, he has, again, two fastballs, two breaking balls, and a changeup. Um, four seam, the two seam, go the same velocity. The slider being his number one pitch. Per nines are pretty mid, pretty average. Control on the two seam, the knuckle curve is pretty unspectacular uh then the break of the curveball is also pretty not great so uh yeah probably not something i'm gonna be going for there uh we do have golds back in the mix so jake fraley for the mariners i don't know man looks like a gold card uh he has really good feeling of course um but he kind of looks like a gold card to me and we got luke williams team usa uh again third base can play a lot of positions uh good splits against left-handers that being said i don't, I don't think it's gonna crack my starting lineup but again it's a gold card uh, i didn't really expect it to so um those are the new top snow cards that's a uh, second voice crack of the video uh, i know that we have a new conquest map oh yeah for top snow um i don't uh yeah that's i no there's no way i'm gonna be able to get this done actually in time uh i'm sure j pro will have it up on twitter so you guys can go follow him there uh and follow gomer there if you have not yet as we mentioned for the second time again in this video um so there's gonna be hidden packs here i think it's 25k xp that you're gonna get for doing that conquest map here's the point where you can laugh oh my god you're level 11 not even wow that's so embarrassing I know, I guess, 25k XP you're going to get from the Conquest map, so 55k in total, uh, if I'm doing the math correctly, 30k plus 25, yeah, that sounds about right for the uh, Dave Parker and the Conquest map, let's go ahead and check out the schedule, may make a video talk, uh, well, I'm not going to make a video talking about it because they didn't update, well, they did update it, what do you know, spoke too soon, why do they got Vlad on there if he didn't get a card? <laughs> Am I gonna am I gonna clickbait it by him over the show? Do they know that I don't want to see Robbie Ray up there? Uh, that that is a fair point. Uh, Otani's the Derby. How cool is that, huh? Stance lefties event. Uh, should be same rewards that we got the other day. Uh, new BR cards. That's gonna be on Tuesday. Roster update on Friday. Uh, Tom Snell moments. New headliner pack. Uh, again, I find it hard to believe that we're not gonna get set three of that uh kitchen sink pack so uh maybe we'll talk um, uh, i don't know what's gonna happen my flight's tomorrow i don't want to miss another upload but uh father's day is on sunday say happy father's day to your dad uh you know if you have one around so uh, that would be much appreciated and i expect you to do that i expect you to check in and let me know what you said to him make him a nice breakfast bacon and eggs make him a steak uh, I don't know. That's, if I was a dad, that's what I would appreciate. Uh, leave a like if you guys enjoy. As always, thank you all for watching. I hope you guys have a good day. There goes some out. Yeet.